Hey guys, welcome back. So today on this video, we're talking about a Toyota Prius and more specifically the newer one. Well, I guess newer to me, this is a 2013. I think these models run maybe like 2010 to 2013. Uh, I'm not too sure if you happen to know, leave a comment below. But this is a 2013 and I'm gonna show you how to turn off the oil maintenance required light right here. As you can see, let's see here. Yep, so this is the, the dash light that happens when you need to change the oil on your car. And if you're like me, you don't go to the dealership to get your oil changed just because the price is pretty high. So if you wanna take it somewhere else, sometimes they don't really know how to turn off the oil maintenance light. So my oil has already been changed and I'm gonna show you how to turn this off now. Pretty easy process, guys. So first off, what you're gonna to wanna to do is go ahead and I'm gonna do this from the off position on the car. So let me go ahead and turn off my car. So as you can see, there's no lights there on my car. The dash is off as if I was getting out of my car. So if you're getting into your car, what you're gonna to wanna to do is hop in and press the power button twice. So one, two, once you do that, then your dash is gonna turn on. Okay, so it's starting to beep right now. All right. So now the dash is on. And next, what you're gonna do is press this trip button. And what you're gonna do is change the trip from where it is, wherever it is, mine says odometer, and then you're gonna to wanna to press it until it goes to trip A. So let me see if I can back out. So what's, I'm gonna press trip. Okay, so now as you can see, it's in trip A. Also, another thing you wanna do is see how it's in miles per hour right here. You wanna make sure that that is kilometers per hour. And how you do that is there's another button down here called KMH or MPH. Mine's on the left here. I used to have another Prius. It's, it was over here on this button, but for some reason it's on this side. And then what you wanna do is press that until it goes to kilometers. So let me go ahead and press it now. And as you can see, it goes to KMH. So then you're gonna have KMH and trip A. Now we're good to go. Next, what you're gonna to wanna to do is turn off the car. So I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, now the car is off. Now you're gonna to need to press this kilometers per hour button and hold it down before you turn the car back on. So you're gonna hold with that side. So I got one button I'm pressing over here and then I'm also gonna press this button. And through the whole process, keep this kilometers per hour button down. So I'm gonna press it now. Okay, that one's down and I'm gonna turn the power on now. And then we're gonna switch over to the dash and you'll see that there's a chart that changes. So power on and then as you can see right here, resetting maintenance now and complete. Now it's gone. Now I can go ahead and let go of this button because I'm still holding it. I'm gonna let go of it. It's off and the power for the car, the engine is on the second. It's got the orange light on there now and the kilometers per hour is still there. Trip A is still there. Now, if you work in miles per hour or kilometers an hour, it doesn't really matter. You can choose. So just be sure to press this back to MPH if that's what you work in. So I'm gonna press it once. Now my dash is MPH and the maintenance required light is now gone. So I can go ahead and turn on the car and that's not gonna come up. It's going to reset the notification there. So that is how you can reset the oil light for your Toyota Prius. Mine 2013 Toyota Prius plug-in. But once again, main thing you wanna do when you're checking on that is KMH MPH for your screen. Thanks a lot. Be sure to leave a comment below.